Well, today's a very exciting day, isn't it, Ballo? Hey, eh? it's giving you something to bark at, hasn't it? You maniac! Men have arrived, haven't they? Yes, there they are. Down the bottom of the garden, you can't get out slot. See those men down there? Where are we? And he's come to build my new workroom. So the heavens have opened, absolutely typical. And Harry's <laughs> still down there measuring. He's going to go now, go and get some timber, and he's going to be back tomorrow. It was a good start. Got the platform down anyway, the base. So we've gone now for the day, and Ballo's straight down here, straight down to inspect what's been going on. So that base down there is six metres by four metres, which is actually only a tiny bit smaller than my work in there. So I thought it was going to be really big, but it's. Um, it's quite small now it's in, so we just have to um, re-turf the lawn after these little bastards have churned it up, put a path down, trim all the hedges. <sighs> just a bit to do. <laughs> So look, more progress. Two ends have gone on this morning and that front panel. So Harry's been and gone already today. It's like a flipping whirlwind. Quarter past eight he was here. <laughs> it's far too early for us. God. Anyway, he's done that. He's built those, I think, yesterday afternoon and come and put them up this morning. He's gone back to get another front piece with a door and a window in it. Um, he only just made it because his van broke down. <laughs> the front in our cul-de-sac. But anyway... Uh, we've helped him jump start it. We've used our old jalopy to tow him. I say we, Steve has. He's been out, not me. <laughs> I've just got dressed. Anyway, not even midday yet, so progress, good. There's some progress on the shed front. Actually, it looks like a little house. <laughs> I just realised how much, I think it's that door. I really don't like that door, so I'm going to paint it, but it was cheap. There we go. Obviously, still got to finish the roof, and then it'll stop raining inside and dry it off. Um, and then it's got to be insulated and boarded out inside, and then a bit of electrics, and it's done. Quite exciting. And then we've got to build a path and turf the lawn. Uh, what else have we got to do? Finish cutting the trees back. I might have to tear that one up at the bottom there. That's like a gaping wound in it. Anyway, all progress. I'm very pleased. And so far I'm getting today because it's pissing down. So I'm not going to go slip sliding down there. I might nip down after for a nozzy. But I sort of want to wait till it's the roof's on proper before going.
I've locked it badly. Can't get in. You're gonna have a go, aren't you? <gasps> I knew you would. You little bugger. Oh, that's the lock. Yeah, locked it. Tough. Haha. -ha. So here I am in my new workroom. All finished. I'll say finished. Finished building it. I've just got to paint it. I've got to get that on there with that little roller. I can't find the big one. <laughs> and nicely mixed in a Spratz tub, so hopefully it won't filter through the smell. So I better get going, hadn't I? Just coming down to do some more paint, and I started it last night. I couldn't update it because don't you dare. Look at me door. Look at that. It's like a monster's been. Well, yeah. Not even trying to hide your guilt. Yeah, it was me. What of it? Come on, open the door, human. Well, I'm going to open it, but you're not coming in. He's just going to hang around here now all day and jump up at this door, no doubt. There you go. <laughs> Give it up. For now. So anyway, I was saying, my workroom's done. Look. So I started painting the ceiling, which is a bit of a mammoth task. <laughs> I only did that much last night. My shoulders are burning. Ugh. So I've got to do this end and then obviously another coat or I can leave it that textured effect. Will I get away with that, do you reckon? Mm, not sure. Anyway, I've got a slightly different colour for the walls, a sort of grey colour, so it's just not going to look all bland and white. So, uh, better get on. Sort of debark, I mean, uh, <laughs> you bark, but you <laughs> barks vertically for like maximum projection. <laughs> He's getting really pissed off now. He might come back for a climb up the, up the door. Oh, perhaps get the message. You're probably going to destroy something there in protest. Yeah, some tools there, that'll do. Can I pick up? Oh, it's over here. <laughs> He's trying everything to get in it in there. He's been barking at me at the front, been walking all the way around the building. <laughs> People feel like now when they get stalked by bears in log cabins in the middle of Canada somewhere. <laughs> Jump up again. Yeah. yeah, he's gonna find a look around there. Can't get around there. There's a gate there built just for you to stop you. I can hear him. Actually pushing at that gate. God, I've never known anything like it. <laughs> Watch this, he'll jump. Watch him try and jump up here now. Fuck <laughs> it in. Balu, no. Are you just missing me? Oh, are you just... Oh. Okay. Okay. Get down. Get down. I might have just wind him up. Oh, my wind is filthy now, look. All of you now. 
So update, paint's on the walls, not the best paint job in the world by far, but it's done, it's clean, it's bright, used all the old paint up, I'm happy. Lights are up, quite pleased with those, they're really good actually. Good cheap wicks, LED strip lights, I put those up. Might have to do something about the cable, although I could leave it as a sort of burglar device, wire it up to the door handle maybe. Anyway, I've just been laying out where the tail is going to go. This is one corner, that's another. And then the other corner will be there, and that's where the other corner will be. So it's quite big, my table. So, um, But I've still got all this space at the end here to put the machines. I've got a desk in the corner. Get rid of the shit off the floor, put the carpet down. Jobs are good in. So there's my happy dogs. Digging bloody holes. Look, see, right on cue. <laughs> oh, Daisy's slopping off because she hates me pointing the camera at her from wherever I am. Just weird. Anyway, not what I'm coming to film. Just showing you my workroom. Doesn't look like much has happened in here since I last updated, but I have done quite a bit. Um, there's a new cable gone in all the way up the shed. Not the shed, the fence. I had to crawl behind that bloody Catoni Aster, which I hate, but I'll leave in because the bees love it. <laughs> That's the only reason I'll leave it there. And then across the house. So that still needs connecting up properly. Um, and then I can put my lights on. Um, I've got some hooks, put my long rods and stuff up there. One shelf in. Now, it looks really wonky, doesn't it? But it isn't, I assure you. <laughs> it's because of the sloping ceiling. No, it better not be wonky. Well, it's level to the floor, put it that way, so Harry's built the shed wonky then. It's not level. So I've cut some more pieces, got to put those up later on, just need some more brackets. And then this weekend, we have van and help. So I'm going to shift everything in one go, hopefully, which will be a bit of a nightmare because the other workroom is absolutely crammed full. So I've got to sort of I've got to empty it upside down because I need to fit the carpet first, which I've got to take up from the old workroom. So I've got to put all the stuff in the van, finishing with the carpet, put the carpet down, and then take everything out of the van and back in the room. So it'll be fun, fun, fun. <laughs> Not sussed this one out yet, have you? No. Thankfully, the handle's a bit stiff. Otherwise, it'd be in here. I'll take a shot. Little sod. This is Ted joining in the game. Can't run around anymore, so he just stands in the middle of the We can't tell him to shut up because he's deaf and he can't hear us tell him to shut up.
let me fold. Ow. 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 Anyway, I'm back in the workroom now because I must get this finished. No, I've still not made much pro more progress than I put on the other day. But I've moved all this table, three sewing machines, eyelet machine, carpet, the contents of the workroom are pretty much packed in cars and places all over the place. There's a million rolls of I moved all that, but I managed to hurt my foot trying to get hold of the dog. <laughs> Didn't do it doing this, no. Trying to get hold of the big stupid dog because he's taken to jumping up at the fence next door. So we're just trying to stop him doing it. And he wrong footed me, the slipper fell off. And I jabbed my foot into the gravel, or actually, I think it might have been like, we have a plastic grid thing underneath the gravel to hold it in place. And I think I might have, oh, I don't, anyway, I would show you, but there's two things I've had I would never do on Instagram and that show me feet. <laughs> Nothing wrong with my feet actually, but I just think, I don't understand why people want to show the feet on Instagram. They're not the nice, not the nicest feature of anybody really. Anyway, that and sitting on the toilet. Why anybody would want to show themselves sitting on the toilet, even trying to emulate a famous person's famous iconic photograph, if you can call it that. I don't get. Not for me, thanks. Going out to the workroom. Steve's apparently brought two more carloads of stuff down, so <laughs> I'm going in to see what else I need to put in places I didn't know existed in this workroom yet. Apparently, there's still another. I think he thinks like I don't know, four or five carloads still to come. I don't know where it's all, I don't know where it's all going from. It's ridiculous. Bear in mind, this workroom is I think we worked out four square meters smaller than the, my old one in Parvold. Um, but in the old one I had a kitchen area and a big like a partition unit thing that I'm not putting in here. So I don't, I don't quite know what's happening. I think, I think perhaps somebody might be introducing stuff and putting it in the workroom and Steve just keeps bringing it down. No, I'm kidding myself. Anyway, I'm gonna go and see what's in here. All right. God. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, oh, God, there's more over there. Look as well. Oh, my God. Right, this desk table was empty last night when I left. It was full, full yesterday, and I cleared it, and I put everything under the table. And actually, I had a massive clear out, and I've got about five bin bags of stuff that's going, or bits of fabric and stuff I'll never use. But, uh, Oh God, <laughs> so now I've got to find space for all this now, wish me luck.
wreck everything. I'm doing this because you've wrecked the garden and then you wreck the garden before I put it down. Yeah, just, you just unroll it. Wreck it more. Just wreck it. Stop it. Have a go, you're dirty. I suppose I should move that knife really, shouldn't I?